whether it was not having the right amount of guys on the field and during certain special teams. And, you know, we're just going to have to get together, watch film tomorrow, Monday, and then just, you know, fix our errors and then go on to next week. You mentioned some of those. What was the most disappointing piece of, of this? Uh, just the fact that, you know, we could have won this game. And if it wasn't for us making countless errors, uh, you know, we, we would have had a different ending. Jonah, how much do you think about having Danny on the field in the second half? Just his leadership, communication, the uh, You know, it sucks not having Danny uh, on the field in the second half, but, you know, we have uh, great guys behind him that you know, are locked in every week at practice, taking reps at practice, and know what they're doing. So, you know, not having Danny is definitely, uh, you know, it hurts us, but, I mean, we still have guys, you know, the next guys up that are ready to go and play. What was the mood, the message in the locker room? I'm sorry, what did you say? The mood, the message, locker room afterwards. Now we just got to pick it up. You know, this is a really humbling experience for us. Uh, you know, we just got to come uh, to every game, every practice, and start off fast. We can't start slow. And, you know, we can't be shooting ourselves in the foot with penalties and not having the right amount of people on the field, you know, when we need to have 11 people on the field. Uh, you know, I'm not really sure what happened there. I mean, you know, we just, whatever Coach Venables or whoever is telling us what to do, we, you know, we go ahead and execute what we're supposed to do. And I mean, you know, obviously things didn't go in our way, and you know, we're just gonna have to fix that come Sunday, come Monday for you know next week, next uh, Saturday. How disappointing is it to play this way after the way you guys played last week? You had two straight weeks, just kind of like this. Uh, you know, it's not a good feeling. Uh, we're not performing to the level that we need to be performing at. Uh, you know, we need to definitely start fast um, and, you know, just stay together, keep our heads up, and, you know, just keep pushing forward. Gentlemen, uh, they scored a, you guys got a touchdown, they, they scored, you guys had the double on sports and Mike, and, and then had the targeting down on the goal line. Just that drive really kind of seemed to swing the momentum back for them. Did you sense it sort of going that way in that moment? Uh, never at all in the game do I doubt us coming out on top. You know, I, I trust our offense, I trust our defense. So, you know, when we go out, we execute and we do what we're supposed to do. You know, I, I, I never doubt what happens. You know, one bad play might happen, but, you know, that it's the mentality that you have to have, you know, a winner mentality you have to have to, you know, you might mess up one play, but you have to come back to the next play and just forget about what happened last play and, you know, keep going. The fact that you guys get that interception by Ethan late, do you think that turns it, that, that gets it back in our favor? I mean, that was a big play, uh, you know, definitely helped the momentum come back on our way. Uh, you know, we just got to capitalize off of turnovers and, you know, makes our plays that we make.